I took out my bag and realized it was mute as well. I pulled out a pen. The paper was just dark white, the whitest thing in the room. My pen was the blackness that seemed to go on forever. It wasn't just really dark black, it was almost as if it was a void. Master Wayne, I believe there's a visitor for you. Ah, good evening. It is a pleasure to make your acquaintance. Right, guys. Um, I know this is a bit dangerous, and I'm sorry for dragging you all into this, but I know we can do it. We just have to stick together. Right? It's not what it looks like. Look, 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 I mean, I promise I did not steal that diamond. Uh, it just happened to fall in my lap. Uh, and I was actually on my way to return it to the rightful authorities, uh, as a good uh, Australian citizen should. Uh, not that I'm necessarily Australian, you understand? Listen here, bub. If you touch me again, you're gonna lose that hand. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Um... It's a pleasure to meet you. Uh, my name isn't important. I'm, I'm just a... Uh, I'm just a helping hand. Um, if you would like towels or anything else, um, please let me know. Um, the, the hotel's room server should be uh, on your desk. Uh, have a lovely night, Father. Hey! How's it going? You ready to go to the palace today? What? Ah, oh, come on. Can't we just skip that? Well, shit. I reckon we're in real trouble right now, Bucky. What's that? You can't talk, you're a horse. <laughs> Status report. I'm sorry, what? <laughs>